I'm JM, and I'm gonna show you how to turn this into this. To smoke pork ribs, it's very simple, easier than you might think, especially on your Mac Grill's Two Star General. The first thing you got to do is configure the grill appropriately. Mac Grill's rib rack. This is an eight tier rib rack that holds your ribs vertically so you can fit more on the grill. Taking a close look at it, you see the construction is welded very good. It's all stainless steel and it's very wide that has tapered edges on the outside just in case you've got extra long racks of ribs. Also, just for versatility, we're going to be using an upper half grill grate. The upper half grill grate allows for more space, like a second floor inside the chamber of your grill. Matt Grills also offers a full upper grill grate. If you really prefer your ribs to be smoked horizontally, then you can lay down more in the main chamber and they're going to smoke just the same as the top as they are on the bottom shelf. Matt Grills offers a hazelnut blend that also has some fruit woods, some other hardwoods to maintain a constant temperature. My last cook though, I had hickory pellets in. This is a 20 pound pellet hopper, holds 20 pounds of any pellet you prefer. With hickory, uh, just like I said, it's good for most things, but we want something new, we want something different, so let's change it out. I'm not gonna have to scoop them out and put them in a bucket. They've installed into the pellet hopper a quick release pellet door that with a twist of your thumb and a lift of your hand, you get to change out all the pellets no matter what flavor was in there. I love how there's a wide bottom strong shelf that can hold just about anything you want and it's the same powder coating and the same material used in the legs. Very strong. These are the Matt Grills hazelnut pellets. Let's go ahead and add them into the hopper. This is your Matt Grills Two Star General Pellet Boss. This controls the temperature, the settings of your grill, and what they call the set point. That's the temperature that is really registered inside the chamber. To get your Two Star General started, it's very simple. as a push of a button. Make the set point for 275 degrees. Here's how you do it. Simply hit this star button. You'll see the set point start to blink. Hold the up arrow to the desired degree. We're looking at 275. Press the star button again, and you're ready to go. The two different sauces we're gonna be using are Matt Grill's Smokin' Whiskey Sauce, and we're gonna be using Matt Grill's Honey Stinger Sauce. We're also gonna be using Matt Grill's Sweet Rub. You definitely wanna add a sweet rub as a base of your ribs, because that's what people are expecting to taste. Take the entire slab of ribs. You wanna liberally add the rub all over. And it's called a rub because we rub it in. Both sides? Oh, yes, we do. We don't play games here. Now let's load it up. I like to have it up front to load the food and then push it towards the middle and back when I'm done. Let's check back on these ribs, maybe in a couple hours.
underneath this tool hook and the warming box is the drip bucket. Now this drip bucket does its job. Check that out. That's all the extra fat, and you can see it's just continuously draining underneath the warming box. They designed this grill right, and this holds up to a quart of fat, so you can have a lot of meat on there and get the job done cleanly and safely. Let's see if they're done. There you go. See that breakage right there? See how it's cracking right there? Excellent, this is a rack of ribs ready to go. Even if you're new to ribs, this two-star general will take care of you, will make it easy on you. As you can clearly see here, let's go ahead and pull them off. So we've got here a full rack of St. Louis pork ribs off of your Two Star General, but the true test is giving it a cut inside and seeing the texture and the results inside the meat. Let's do it. You know, for some people, even seeing isn't believing. Let's put our hands on it and let's feel the pull apart texture of your ribs. That's how you make pork ribs on your Mac Grills 2 Star General. Now you're smoking.